So guys, over the past few days, we have seen a few videos. I myself have posted one. A few other content creators have posted them too. Within the famous, also beautiful bird and hill rune farm. Uh, where you can actually come here now. You don't have to fight any enemy. And basically sling yourself off the map on your horse. Swing and you'll earn tons of runes out of it. Now I'll showcase it to you guys if you don't know about it. There's actually a new spot you can do this as well. But today I want to explain to you guys exactly what's actually going on here. I'll showcase to you the new spot as well. And why I believe this is still the best spot. But hey, let's get into it. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so this spot, it's within the Siofa River. Within the, um, the Dynasty area. The also famous area. Now if you want a guide on how you get down here, I'll put a... A video in the video description it's called 13 portals and hidden areas and it'll showcase you exactly how you get here also how you get up to the deep root depths where we will go to in a quick second where i'll showcase to you guys the new spot you can do this but hey if you don't know what i'm talking about but you do know about this area you know about the bird they can shoot new ones off the map you know about the hill you can take out with a relic sword there's actually a new spot here we don't need to fight anything can i jump on your horse and you come this way and I'll explain to you exactly what's going on here and why you're getting actually getting runes and what's going on. I think the game's glitching out. It's weird as heck, but actually it kind of, well, it don't make sense, but it makes sense what the game's doing <laughs> and why it's rewarding you runes. It's absolutely nutty. Also, guys, I want to apologize about my voice as well. I do have a crazy cold and it's killing me. So from here, jump onto here, guys. Jump up again. Probably the hardest part. Not going to lie. And when you're up here, you are good. You are good good so if you've seen this for the first time it's gonna surprise you but what's actually happening here guys is my theory anyway is the game is registering all the enemies in the area dying and it's giving you the runes for said enemies they can come across a bit further here also guys if you have your golden scarab on use that if you have those gold foul feet use them too but hey so if you come here it can be anywhere, if you, don't, if you go too far to the right it will kill you. But if you come anywhere around here guys, double jump, has to be a double jump. And just swing your weapon on your horse and fall, you will earn runes out of this. Now you ain't actually getting them when you, because a lot of people are showcasing when you turn to the grace points, you're getting them, you actually ain't. You get them straight away, you'll see I've got no runes on me now. And you'll see it'll pop up say like between four and 7,000. That's what it'll say. If you actually look at the count, you get a ton more than that. And also doing this as well, there's two ticks. So you'll get one set of runes, and if you keep going, you'll get another set of runes. After that, I haven't got any more. I've heard people say I've got four uh, ticks of runes. I haven't myself. But hey, and if you do go on for too long, you will fall to your death and die. But hey, you'll see in a quick second. It does take about probably about 30 seconds of falling, maybe. Uh, but once you get the root down, you, you can earn. I wouldn't say it's as quick as the hill with the relic sword, but hey, you need to take out the elden beast to get the remembrance to even get the relic sword so you need to complete the game first to do that i'm doing this as, as well by the way in in standard play this isn't this isn't new game plus at all this is just a standard so runes is what you'll see you got seven thousand there but watch the count say so it went to 152,000, but it only said seven thousand and you'll see i'll get another tick in a second about two thousand plus and you can do this forever constantly so when you get the second tick pop up guys, which come, should come in a, there you go, right there. Probably about an extra 10, Just then just go back to the grace point. Simple as that. And then you can just rinse and repeat this. You can just rinse and repeat this. And there we go guys. But now, as I said, there is another spot you can do this on, but it ain't as good. Now you'll see a lot of videos where they showcase this to you. And you need to come up to the, great, uh, the deep root depths by the way, and like I said, that video will be linked below if you don't know how to get to these areas. So yeah, you'll see a lot of videos on YouTube of people doing this and them getting the Newman's runes. Uh, what's actually happening is, guys, like I said uh, just, that the game's thinking you're killing things in the area and it's rewarding you what you'll get from said enemies. I've seen people do this and get an Ash of War. I've seen people do this and get weapons. And I've seen people do this and get the Newman's runes. The Newman's runes, I believe, can only do once and they come from enemies in the area. Now, if you've already killed the enemies in the area, when you do this, you won't get the actual uh, Newman's runes. You'll just get probably like 40 or 50k runes. So that's why I said I believe the first spot is better. 
And a Newman's ruins, where you get them from, there's actually a cave over here somewhere. I can't exactly remember. I did this so long ago. Um, it's not this way. You go this way down, I believe. And I think you climb up that branch there, maybe, to my right. But you'll see a cave. There you see the cave opening right there. This cave right here. So if you come up in here, guys, if you haven't been here already, there's a load of those. Um, it's like an ant's nest, shall, shall I say? A load of these dudes here. There's also those big gooey ball things, which if you take out, you get those numerous runes for it. And like I said, if you haven't killed these already the first time you'll do this, you will get said Newman's runes. So that's why if you're watching other people's videos and they're getting those Newman's runes out of this and you're wondering what's going on, it's because they haven't been in that cave yet. It's weird, but hey, it's the way it goes. So what you want to do, guys, is, is make your way. Let's follow the path I'm taking now on the screen. And uh, once the battle music stops, I'll showcase you exactly where we're trying to get to. There we go. We're trying to get to here. Across the route. Oh, shit. Yeah, it's run away. But that's where we're trying to get to. That's actually where we're going we're gonna to end up. So let's follow the path I'm taking. If you haven't already done this. But we're going up there, guys. We're going up there. Now, I was just testing this earlier. And you can see I died. That's why I've got runes up there. All right, mate. Have I gone past where we got to go? I can't even remember. No, I don't think I have. I think we're good. I think we're good and I think we can get up this way. Let's go up on this roof. But yeah, that's what's actually happening. The game's picking up weirdly. So yeah, the game's picking up a registry. When you're jumping off and swinging, and you do have to swing, by the way. If you stop swinging, you die as well. Weirdly. Ooh, well, hello, I'll take you. No, I won't. I'm on pasture. But yeah, the game's registering things in the area. And when you actually just swing, you'll just get rewarded things in said area. And that's why with the bird farm within the uh, Morgan Dynasty area, you're getting a ton of runes. Now, I haven't tried it with Morg Alive. If people have got Morg Alive, try it and see if you get his runes as well, because that's 500k. It's probably only a one-time thing, but hey. Okay, so here's the grace point, which I'm going to activate while I'm here. And this is the actual other spot. We can do this. Now, this one's a bit more of a pain in the ass to get to. But hey, you'll see anyway, you don't get that many runes from it. And like I said, the Newman's runes and that, I believe they're a one-time thing. Once you've had them once, you can't get them again. If you could, this would be disgracefully incredible. But because like I said, it's a one-time thing. I don't believe you can get them. Now, this is actually the easier way. I've seen other people post ways of getting up there. You have to go up that way and people are trying to climb up these uh, these is roots now there's a much much easier way and it's like this it's still a pain in the ass but let's stick to the right just keep cut jumping and you'll eventually go up there guys not like that not like that just keep stick to the right now my horse don't want to go up there i don't even know what's going on here come on horsey there we go there we go Hey, he finally did it. Then we want to come up here, jump across here, jump across here, guys, and jump up on here. Just like so. Then turn around, go up this way. Hey, there are my runes. There's my runes. Let me grab them while I'm here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And there we go. Now, we've got to get across there. And this can be deadly because you have to jump onto this slippery thing in front of us. right. One jump, two jump there, and then hopefully you just land and jump again. Simple as that. I fell off there and died, so yeah. And when you're up here, guys, you have to come around here, climb up this way, and you'll see a hole in a wall here. You can see the little text icon there. And if we jump off here, guys, double jump, remember, you have to do a double jump, and then swing your weapon. You'll see, just swing, and you'll see, if you look backwards, you'll see we actually fall past that nest of where those Newman's runes are actually originally obtained. And that's why when you see videos of people doing this, they get rewarded those Newman's runes. You can also get the actual war, which you grab, I'm pretty sure I like cave too. There's a weapon you can get from this area too, which if you haven't got already, you should get that. Um, a smithing stone. I think that you could get the smithing stone more than once, but I think you want to get like 50 or 60K runes and I am using the golden scarab as well, by the way. So yeah. 
but this actually works in any area where I believe you can climb up above the map, like two spots you're not supposed to get to, and just jump off. Now I tried it, I'll show you another actual location I've done this with. Um, it's actually back within that Margaret Dynasty area. But yeah, you don't get as many runes. So yeah, this, this one just keeps with me guys. I think you fall for about 45 seconds to a minute. And I think there's a couple of ticks here as well. Like the first six, like, well, you'll see it anyway in a quick second. I think it's like 60K, I'm not even sure. There we go, there's a one tick. See the, the runes just pile up, it's wild. And it might be, I'm pretty sure there is as well. Another tick. If there ain't, I die. Don't worry about it. I ain't bothered. There we go. And there's the other tick. And that's it, guys. You see the moons just keep coming. It's wild. Bizarre what's happening. Then we can just go back to it. You know, actually, I'm going to look at it. Because I'm pretty sure if you keep going, you do get a smithing stone. Let me just quickly check. If I die, it don't matter. So there's the, there's the third tick. I think actually it might die here. Yeah. Keep swinging though, just keep swinging. Because I think the f when I just did this, I did get a smithing stone. I like, will see. If I die, like I said, oh well. Oh wow, it's only 260k runes, it's nothing. You can get that easily. Come on. Come on. I actually think there's six, you know, the six Newman runes you can get from this area. Um, that one time place. Yeah, I don't think it's going to give it me. I, th I think the Smithy Song may as well, might be as well, a one time thing. But hey, let's just get out of here before I do die. Before I do die. So, yeah, guys, that's basically it. Like I said, I do believe, in my opinion, that um, the Margaret Dynasty area is much better than what we first showcased in the video. Now, the other area within that same actual spot is let me just use this and go over there like i'm saying i went all over i've been looking for different spots to see if there's a an area where there's plenty of ads there where i can get even more runes but i don't think there is guys i don't think there is so from here the actual the actual spot you when you use the um i can't remember what it's called this this cold is absolutely killing me when you use this the pure blood knight's meadow that's the one jump on your horse we'll turn around jump on your horse and come this way like I said, any spot really can get out of the map where you climb up. You can do this. Like I said, there's probably other spots. Please don't get me. Please don't get me. No, no, no. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Shit. Get away. Get away. <laughs> oh, not my horse, man. Are you going to leave me alone, you big old dirty bastard? Yes, I'll use you. Okay, there we go. There we go. We're good now. We're good now. We're good now. We're out of there. Jeez. Here, up here, anywhere you jump off here as well, guys, you also can get runes for it. It's so wild, but like I said, because there's not many ads that many ads around here, you ain't getting as many as you can. So, yeah, there's probably tons of other spots in this game where this can be done. You can get even more runes. I mean, try it out, guys. Try it out. I'm just gonna pick a random spot up here and try it and see what, what happens. So, double jump. Oh, no, 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 double jump whoop and the swing just swing away and see how many we get i'm not even sure how many i got i mean to be honest 265k was it i can't even remember people i can't even remember but yeah it's so weird how this works and what's actually happening it's bizarre man it really is but yeah i do think it is it's just basically calculating ads in the area and giving you the runes they would drop, I'm thinking. I'm thinking. That's why I said if Morg, if you've come here and you haven't killed Morg, the main boss here, you could probably get his 500k runes as well. I'm not saying that's a guarantee, but you probably could if you're close enough to him and he's in the vicinity where the game thinks you've killed him. I don't know. I don't know. It's madness. It is madness, people. Just keep swinging, guys. Just keep it's killing my, my finger's got a six pack. My finger is built like a brick shit house. It's been there. We go. Oh, did that just give me a hundred k then? 
Did that just give me 100k then? I'm sure it did, you know. I'm sure it did. I'm not even sure. I don't know. I don't know. But then, guys, you just simply fast travel back to any grace. And then we are good. Then we are good, guys. And that's basically it. That's how the farm works. It is as simple as that. And guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more out of the ring, be sure to subscribe and hopefully my beautiful people. I will see you on that next one.